what is going on everyone we are back we are getting getting back into some more Baldur's Gate 3 today uh moving along last time we uh ended on some pretty sad notes with the owl bear situation um but the baby is still alive so we'll see where that ends up and uh Kaga back at the Druid Grove we had some unfortunate mishaps going on there so we will see what all of that leads into. Um, probably not good things, but uh, it's D and D, and that's how things go. You just kind of roll with the punches. Um, but let's go ahead and hop over. Thanks for hanging out. If you if you like what you're watching, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get into the game. All righty, let's get back into this. Uh, like I said, we finished up last time with the Owl Bear Cave. So that's where we were kind of figuring out where we wanted to go. And we talked to everyone, so I think we just jump out of here. Um, as far as the quests go, continue traveling with Astarion. We'll find more about his vampirism. Um, and then... We found a special parasite that looks like our own. We're drawn to his potential. Can I use that? We did get that. Okay, let's let's loot our or do this value, right? Type, type. Um, we tried to use it the last time. Unready. Refuses both to leave or to allow itself to be used as you desire. Okay. Well, we'll figure that out when we get to it. No big deal. And then. Uh, save the refugees. We did that. We just have to stop the goblins. Uh, the rest of it is... A wizard named Gale joined the party. He claims to be... Have been on the Nautiloid, which means he's infected too. Um... This is just a Starian. We just keep traveling with him. And this is we need the Githyanki Kresh. And then we have to go find Karlak. Okay, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. And then Shadowheart, which we haven't been doing a lot with Shadowheart. So, which I... Whatever. I kind of like this party, honestly. I kind of really like it. We have... Um, I mean, myself, obviously, I'm... Big, mean, barbarian. Kind of tanky, too, because we want the bear... Bear build? Am I am I remembering that right? We, we chose bear, yeah. Yeah. And then... Uh, Lazel is going into War Domain Cleric, and we got Ranger Rogue. I bind. And then yes. Gale is full on wizard, so we're sitting pretty good in a party, I think. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Let's go here. Oh, I guess we can go to Roadside Cliffs, because everything I think that we need, yeah, is way over here now. We kind of we kinda got all this. We got the grove done. Not very well, but we did it. Um, <laughs> it kind of went poorly. Uh, we did all the ancient stuff, like in this, uh, the ruins over here. We did that when we found uh, Withers. So then we just have to go. Carlac is up here. Uh, Auntie Ethel. We can go talk to her, old lady. That she could help us maybe with the, the spooky ooky in our eyeball. Um, Goblin Camp and the Goblin Priestess, and then the Githyanki Crash. Okay, let's. So, either way, we have to go this way, I, I believe, along this road. Speak. I don't want to talk to you yet. That's not what I was trying to do, ma'am. Roadside Cliffs. That's where I'm trying to go. All right. Uh, let's go not. Need something? A star in. I swear. Oh no! Can we go here and go over? <gasps> oh, we. It makes it so much faster. Okay, yeah, we'll go over here. I feel like maybe go to Carlac first or Auntie Ethel. Those are those are the two that I'm thinking. 
I don't want to go to the, go the goblins yet. That seems like a lot. But give me a hungry look, and I'll drive a stake through your heart. Something good here, I hope. I do so very like spicy food. Dead. Their conversation is so funny. It's dead. Let's go. That's hilarious. Uh, so it looks like we can go down here and go up and over. Do we want to do that to get to Carlac? Oh, wait, this is, um, this is back to the moon. The, the cave. Not moon, owlbear. I was thinking of Moonkins from WoW. I've been I've been playing way too much WoW. Way too much WoW. The new expansions got me s sucked into it. All right, yeah, I think we can get to Carlac. Oh, I heard people. What? Grab this stuff. Prowess in battle is remarkable, as is your battle stance itself. Rathajak, a technique known to few outside Kalir. Shall I teach you? Hmm. I'll pass. Is that a doggy? I prefer abjuration over acrobatics. Wait, wait, wait. No we gotta be able to talk. Scratch? Keep moving, stranger. Quietly. What happened here? I told, I told you, you to go. go. I'm not an enemy, I promise. I'm not going to intimidate the poor dog. Why would I, why would I do that? <laughs> Come on. Thank you. Thank you. You see a name etched into the leather. Scratch. You're Scratch, aren't you? Come here, it's alright. You know my name? Interesting. A predator wouldn't care to learn it. Still, his you should go. His happy little tail my wags. Is injured. He needs rest. Oh, poor Scratch. Oh, that's super sad. His his owner died. I don't think he's gonna wake up. Of course he will, and then we'll return home. Oh, dogs are so loyal. That's so sad. Um, you can travel with me if you like. No, I won't leave him. If he doesn't wake up, follow my scent. I have a camp. If it comes to that, I may. Thank you. Oh, that's so sad. I can't even loot him. I'd feel horrible. Oh, <laughs> poor doggy. I think, I think Vivi would be devastated if that happened to me. She outside of the road people. Can't imagine Mother Gith would approve. Doesn't she prefer us lesser species enslaved or eviscerated? We are to use and misuse each civilization in the stars in every way we know. Very bush. She'd be putting down the work in different ways, huh? Okay. Hey, whatever you gotta do, I guess. Whatever you gotta do. Okay, can we go up? I thought we were trying to get to Carlac. Can we not get to her from here? Well, I've been misguided. Is this a ruse? You find well, but efficient. Why not have a little fun? Oh! What's that? Rocky crevice. I don't think we can. Yeah, we can't get in there. 
You are not tiny. Okay, well, I guess that's not... Oh, oh, these people. Wait. Yeah, these are the guys from, uh... The Tiefling camp. Or, not the Tiefling. The Druid camp that we fought with. What's up for discussion? They got... Thought they punched him out. With the foul bloods in Elson's Grove. Uh, knock it off with that foul blood shit. Yeah, whatever you say. Don't matter anymore. Tieflings. You don't gotta be rude. Goblins. God, this contract was cursed from the first. What, so you have a problem with me because I'm an orc? Hmm? A few goblins killed your whole crew? Pathetic. Wasn't no few goblins, mate. <laughs> There's an entire hive of them. Yeah. Contract failed to mention that part. What was the contract? The kind that leaves half your crew dead. There's a wizard in Baldur's Gate that will pay gobloads for a relic, supposedly buried round these parts. But gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Let's say I want that gold. Where can I find the relic? It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you a map of the temple and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own sodger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. Yikes. Oh, got the contract. Can show you where we turn back. If you feel like dying. Thanks. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'll be well on my way to Boulder's Gate when you die. I haven't had any problem with goblins yet, so... I'm just glad to be rid of the bloody thing. Happy hunting. Come on. All right. We're wasting time. Let's see... Uh, I guess they're just running, running away. Uh, tiefling? Dead tiefling? Movement on the roofs. I sense a classic ambush in the making. Oh, okay. Get over there! Surround them like! I know you're up there. Show yourselves. You spotted us! Good! It's like they say, no fun in skewing a pig what doesn't know he's cooked. There will be no skewering happening here, now let me pass. We got you surrounded. Here's how this goes. You take one step further, and we'll fill your front with arrows. Or you turn around, and your backside gets the same treatment. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Oh, so she's one of the, one of the Awoken or whatever? Um, we can do Persuasion, Illithid Wisdom. That seems lame. Well, I'd be like, I, uh, these, these have been like guaranteed, haven't they? Ah, we're a Barbarian. We're a Half-Orc. You know we got to. Oh, it's a 10? Easy. Let's go. Come on. I should not have spoken so soon, but we got it. <laughs> Hold up, lads. This one might be more we bargained for. I feel like I need to keep go my mouth then. shut when the dice are Just rolling. Keep your nose clean. I, I gotta keep my mouth shut when the dice are rolling because it's turned out so poorly for me so often. Gale has a quest. Spare me a moment, if you please. I've something important to discuss with you. Oh, is that so? We've been traveling together for a while now, and it's just about time that I shared something with you. It's a rather personal matter that I'd have preferred to keep quiet, but needs must when the devil drives. I have no choice but to speak. You see, uh -oh. I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. Okay. What kind of condition? Can it be cured? Is it contagious? No, no, nothing like that. Now, if I fail to treat it, then the consequences would not be contained to me alone. What it comes down to is this. 
Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. That sounds annoying. <laughs> that sounds like something we have to deal with, and that's going to be annoying. Um, your illness causes you to re consume raw magic. I'm going to need details. I can say no more on the matter. Not now, anyway. Just trust me when I say it's all of vital importance. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact. Since before we were abducted. It is time. And by that, I mean it's imperative that I find and consume strands of weave at the earliest possible juncture. Where do you suggest we find these artifacts? You know, I... I've enjoyed Gale. I'd be happy to help. You have my thanks. And fear not. Your implicit trust is well placed and will be rewarded with any and all means at my disposal. As luck would have it, you're already primed to give me exactly what I need. Oh, is that, is that so? Um... What will happen to this item should I give it to you? I will consume the magic inside. What was a powerful artifact will be rendered no more than a trinket. But it will save my life. Even if only temporarily. Okay, so he eats our greens? Is that what it is? Aha. Uh -huh. Oh no. What? Oh wait, Gale has... Moondrop pendant. Do we have extra things? Hold on. You're going to have to eat something that we that we have? I don't have any other greens? Oh, that's not even equipped. Oh, th why do I have... Is that a one-hander? It is a hand axe. Okay. Yeah, you can eat this. That's fine. Thank you. Or two-hander. Two-handed boy. It's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters. I'm glad you're feeling better. Your condition sounds unpleasant to say the least. Oh, it's not so bad once you get used to it. And, on the plus side, my tower in Waterdeep has never been so free of clutter. Oh, man. <sighs> Sincerely, though. Of course, he cracks jokes. I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. Um, that condition of yours is a very expensive one. <laughs> I obtained it in Waterdeep. <laughs> Nothing there comes cheap. Uh, yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna be a sassy a sassy orc. All right, so we have free passage through the goblins now? For now? Is that what's going on? Dabby wooden doors. But these goblins aren't attacking us because we intimidated the crap out of them. Oh, you know we need our junk. I got this horrible, horrible habit of collecting everything. Encumbered? Oh god. Um Can we do one of these real quick? I just I've been collecting everything on him. Um So can we just do like Centelazel? Aha. Now we're much better. Perfect. I clip journal. The pupil surpasses the teacher. My master uh, weapons are almost complete. There's just one component left. Samson says the designs are a failure. But what's he know? He can barely see past his own belly. 
<laughs> I stashed the prototypes and blueprints for now. But just you wait, Samson. The legend is fading and a new one will rise in its place. Finish the masterwork weapon. The date on this letter has faded with time, but the paper alone indicates great age. My fellow citizens, for fellow, for fellow citizens we are, like it or not, I print and post multiple copies of this notice in the region at no small expense to myself, because I feel a growing concern and alarm at the presence of strange riders in this pet in these parts of late. Many of you will have seen them tramping through our forests and towns under guise of patrol. They claim they are guardians sent from El Turel to protect the borders of the great and the holy nation of Eltergard. Don't be fooled by shining armor or handsome mounts. I never bent the knee to any Eltergard, and I have never asked any metal gesture to come peering over my garden fence. As you know, I'm descended direct from the original Selunite settlers along these banks, uh, and I have a half-elven great-uncle who will, who will swear it. Uh, of course. Play the card. We're peaceable folks, and we get on with the druids well enough. But I pay no fealty or tax to any far-off city I can't even find on a map. I took no small pleasure in telling these thugs just that, and I urge you to do the same. They call themselves hell riders. I call them interlopers. And they can bugger off into the hills, them and their city both. Tell you night necklace. Looks like a Salunite necklace. Salunite, that's how you pronounce it. Okay, well, now I know. I was just winging it until we figured it out. Old key. Does that get us into the basement? Why did I get on the box to get the key? Crimson, you're hilarious. I'm sorry, my name is Boar, Boar Blood Moon. Not crimson. My mistake. I'm so used to naming all my characters just crimson, but we actually named this guy. Quarterstaff. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Heavy key. The frick does that one go to? Cutting board. We're looking around. I, I, I know we're gonna end up needing camp supplies at some point. Like it's just gonna happen. Okay, these guys are just all up here. Can we go in the basement? Oh, well, maybe not because everyone's coming up. Better not be cursed. Oh, we do have the key. Okay, we should quick save. I need to get used to quick saving in this game. I got used to it in Skyrim again. <laughs> I got used to it in Skyrim again because it gets bad. I need to get used to quick saving more. These tools. It is very dark in here. Do we have a uh, torch? How do we switch to our torch? Aha! Ruffy Vagabond clothes. Boar, you don't gotta get up on things, man. It's not necessary. What's down here? Is rope useful for anything? That's something I don't know. Maybe like crafting? I figured maybe you could use it to like jump down something with it. Like, you know, in D&D. &D. But I don't know how actually like intricate things are. I thought they did a pretty good job of it. Shabby door. 
This looks like a smithy. Oh, a chest. Oh! Be cautious. You couldn't say that like two seconds before I opened it? We found the blueprints. Precise arcs and neatly drawn lines form the blueprints of three weapons. A greatsword, a sickle, and a dagger. Each length and angle is marked with exact measurements, and forging instructions are printed carefully along the bottom of the page, emphasizing an unusual ingredient, Susar Bark. The Susar Bark can only be applied to an ordinary unmodified blade. They call for Susar Bark. If only I knew where to find some. Okay, I guess we need to find Susar Bark. There's a chest up here. Bang! Hey ho, look at that! Infernal iron! Blacksmith note. Oops, I'm so sorry, I just bumped the mic. Too bad that's a... One D six plus four piercing. The one hand. Man. Oh wait, Lazel could maybe use that. Genius. Let's move. Like it's well be done. That's probably way better. Five to ten, four to eleven. But this has, this has the extra on it, doesn't it? No, it's one D six plus four. Hmm. I think we're going to give her the sword. Something about that just seems right. Battle axe. I don't know if that's better, but we're, you know. Um, what? This is what I was using. I was using the Great Axe. Okay. Battle Axe is for... Yeah, that's a versatile. And this is a, a two-handed weapon. Okay. Okay, so if you just hit the toggle button... I got it. I got it. We're figuring it out. Oh, and then you can pick up weapons in here to turn into... I bet that's what it is. Because it said it has to be a, a normal weapon. Raid axe. Sickle. Need to find a way forward. What is that? Okay. Um, hold up. You can bless, or you can give guidance, right? I don't even know who has good investigation. Gale? Aha! All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Cracked wall. Light on my feet. How do we break that? Break it. Wait, can I um a long way from water deep. Can I just go like this? Immune to fire damage. No one back home will ever believe this. Have to keep going. Can I smash it with my weapon? I cannot. Can I throw something at it? 
Well, that was shove, not throw. It did damage. Oh, baby. Okay. Um. Improvised melee weapon. Pick this up. Aha! We're breaking it. Can I throw this wheelbarrow at it? Oh, God. <laughs> First step is uh, Yes. Was that the conventional way to do that? Probably not. Probably not. But boy oh boy did we do it. Well this is spoopy. I don't like this. Not one bit. I not touch the webs. I had to disturb the locals. Don't touch the webs. Can I jump over the webs? Oh god. Gale, what did you do? We woke something. Most likely not from a beauty sleep. Let's quick save. What did you do? There's a backpack. There's some dead people. Oh, there's spitters. There's spitters. Space spider. Okay. Um. I wonder if they'd let me talk. Never mind. Never mind. Um. I really want to get up on the high ground here with with him, but um. I guess maybe we'll just take a take a step back here and then hide. We'll do it my way. That way, maybe I can get some some sneak attacks. Thank God. Enter cap. What? What was that? Okay, I want to get up in this spider's face. I think. Taking position. Um. But then the question is, do we bless? Do we have bless? Do we not have bless? We have all the heals. Okay. That's okay. Um We have divine favor. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh Lazel Put in the work. Girl. Okay, we're doing okay. We're alright. She's taking that thing down. Let's put some put some damage into this bad boy. Wow. I missed that much. That sucks. Do we want to get away from people? Yeah, I think so. Gale, you're kind of squishy. We'll get up in this guy's face. Range it up! And oh, then we smack. Do we reckless attack this bad boy? Or we just swing on him? Oh, that's 94%. I'm not scared. I'm freaking ruthless. And then we have... We can sneak attack this. Oh, baby! Is this a minor action? Can we do that on here? Oh no, too far. Okay, we won't do that. Well, no, we won't do that. Oh, 
Oh, no. Uh-oh. That's not good. Kind of out of our line of sight. Um, I guess we can follow. Not enough movement. Oh, am I in web? Oh, that's butt. Can't, I can't even sacred flame it from here. Oh, no. Can I hit this guy? You bow. Ah, I saved! Okay. Everyone is still doing good. Maybe we should just... We'll get rid of Divine Favor and go Shield of Faith. Let's get tanky. That other Adder Cap's coming, so... They can deal with the Phase Spiders from down here. Can I, uh... I can Misty Step. Awesome. Then we can Witch Bolt. We can Firebolt. I should have Wish Stepped up, or uh, Misty Stepped up to him. Come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Sometimes the only way out is through. Nice. Can I jump up here? Ho oh, ho! We're a madman. Okay, can I I can sneak attack this too. Right? We can go here and then we can sneak attack. Oh my god, it was beautiful. That's fine. Rogue Ranger is just insane. Why is it so good? Can she jump up here? Oh, only if we go there. She jump up here. Oh, maybe. Okay. Oh, nice. It's okay. We can take you out, Mr. Gale. One damage. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Would you pump a little bit harder? Don't waste a step. Oh, we saved two. No, not enough movement. Oh, you gotta be kidding. We can't lose our thing, so we're gonna have to shoot it. Hey, we got some damage. Nice. Okay. Do we just kill this one? Absolutely we do. There was one more over here somewhere. Yeah. I did not mean to touch that, but uh, bronze ring. Okay, and then she can jump. Whoa, whoa, what is happening? Oh, he's running. Oh, she'll f take damage if she does that. Okay. What about if she jumps to there? Oh my god, Lazel, you are a beast. Infested. Two to eight damage per turn. Uh, damage is poison and piercing. Oh, she's got tiny spiders on her? Uh That's not fun. That sounds awful. Can we hit this? No. Come on, can't stay idle. 
Okay, well let's dash. One day I'll catch a break. I'm gonna lose rage here, but it's fine, I guess. Um I don't think we're gonna waste that spell, but we're gonna sneak attack here. It's so good, it does so much extra damage. Aha! Flourish. Possibly throw your enemy off balance. Oh, I guess we could we could do it a an extra attack here. It wasn't needed, but might as well get the kill. Secure the kill. I don't fancy their chances. It shall be done. I can't hit him, right? Target is too far, yeah. Nothing important is ever easy. These boots have seen everything. These boots were made for walking, is what what he should have said. Nice. I love it. That was so good. Is she done being being grossified? Can you can you not, not be grossified anymore? Okay. Short rest. That wasn't that bad, right? Not too bad. I think that was all the oogie boogies down here. At least for now. Frickin' spiders. Adventurer's pack? Alchemist fire. That could have been handy. Antidote also could have been handy. Raider healing potion. Okay. Spider silk cocoon. Good goblin. Okay, let's go up here and look around. Bloodstone? How can I help? I didn't want to talk to you. Um. I guess there is more stuff we can talk to him now, because he had his quest. Yeah, we're going to have to find a place to sell. Um, actually, maybe we can do it back in the Druid's Grove. Uh, do I want to keep going this way? Are there going to be more spitters? Probably going to be more spitters. Probably going to be more spitters. Oh, what in God's name is that? I am not ready for that. That's a level five. Absolutely not. Nope. We're, nope. Nope. We're noping out of here. What's inside? You know how you just... thats That would be me if I was in Australia, yeah? Do uh, you spider? Nope. 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 I lived in New Zealand. There was nothing there that wanted to kill you. New, uh, a little bit different, though. Freaking Australia. I think, every, I think everything wants to kill you in Australia. New Zealand was like the most peaceful place in the in the freaking world. Everyone was so nice too. I loved it there. 
If I could go back, I would. A great sword. Oh, we're gonna need that if we get the um the stuff. We can we can craft with that with the the the, the blacksmithing thing. If we ever find that sap or whatever. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we'll be able to use that. Actually, should we use this anyways? I feel better using the freaking axe just because I'm an orc, but I'm fine with swords. Moss covered chest. Uh, where's my dude? My master lockpick. I can crack that open. Add bonus. Fifteen. Ooh, buddy, you're not you are not as good as a, of a rogue as I thought you were. We have twelve thief stools, so we can just keep cracking. Starring, I'm gonna let myself do this because you are <laughs> you are doing a bad job. At least things have stayed interesting. Wait, is it me doing it? Is that what's going on? I wanted a Starion to do it. With pleasure. Why was I doing it? I clicked on the Starion. This is why I wanted him to do it. He's got a million things that give bonuses. He rolled a one? What are the odds? Thank you. Haste hmm. Helm. Um. Um. That's going on me. That is. Is that a me? Okay, it's not any armor. So that is going 100% on my character. Or what, he has this, which gives nature one, but I type uh, haste, haste, please. And then Trust me. I don't know who who wants nature. Not our vampire second man, Lazel. Do you want plus one nature? Look at you. Now you're adorable. Looking ahead. Now you're adorable. You have a, an adorable, adorable thing on your head. Oh my god. Yeah. At the start of combat, the wearer gains momentum plus three. That's for three turns. That's crazy. Some camp supplies. Nice. It was all worth it. We got there. Grab this arm. Just another crate. Okay, hold up. Hold up, hold up. What is going on up here? How much farther can I go? Rescue the gnome. Look what we got here. Another little birdie wanting to fly. Stop this thing! What? <laughs> Flap those wings some more and I'll feed you a worm. Uh, I will. You. Hope you got a stomach for rights. Um. What the hell are you doing? What's it bloody look like? We're teaching this here pipsqueak to fly. Uh, let me ref... Well, wait. Hmm. I don't know. I think at this point I would just attack. I've... I've been... I've been speaking too many... Too much sense. For a barbarian. 
<laughs> quake game! They're just a bunch of foolish goblins. Uh, oh damn. See, that's the thing with him going, he's so fast that I can't get sneak attacks off. But, the goblin devout, or should we try and pin the goblin, the leader? Um, cause I'm supposed to be pretty good with this, yeah? Nice. Ensnared. Can I grab it? Dang it. Double shot? Dude. What was that? If I run to here. Make way. And then jump. Oh, lame. Let's give ourselves some damage. Nothing will stand in my way. Rage it up. Reckless attack this guy. Oh, it feels so good. Uh, oh, if I could get in here and thunder wave these guys, I can get two of them. <laughs> Dang, it didn't knock him off. Oh, that would have been so freaking good. We tried, though. Gail, you're, you're a man. Oh, he got the blessed backwards, though. That's good. What was that? Okay. Helping down characters can get back up if they regain hit points. Allies can help down characters by healing them or using in the help action. We can throw potions. I know that. Um... Do we have any big potions? I know we have big potions on on Boar. Let's go. If we send those over to him, Shall we cut and, run? and then where's throw? Throw potion of greater healing. Nice. She's back in the fight. Um, that is why we don't want to be grouped up. That is not good. Can I get some high ground anywhere? Can I jump up here? Oh, uh, why don't I have any high ground? Okay. That sucks. Oh, this is hurting. Um I can second win, but I can also I can't throw. I don't have any actions. Can I cleave these guys? That doesn't hit Lazel, right? Oh, baby. Okay, we're good. And then... I need to drink a potion, because we're getting beat up. Saved, good. Stop. I give up. 
Mama Mercy, please. That was it? I know things. If you let me live, I'll make it worth your while. I promise. Is it because we killed one of his goblins? Sniffling makes your blood boil. You could give in to the rage and end the wicked little maggot in one strike. But perhaps he knows something useful. Your head aches as rage fights against reason. Oh, we have to we have to win this rule if we want to calm down. You know what? We haven't we haven't let into our rage at all. Let's do it. No! <laughs> We don't need the info. We'll figure stuff out. Everyone else ran off. Is that what it was? Damn. Hey, we got an upgrade for killing him. I'll take that. have to go back to camp and sleep okay how do we stop this is it inside break lever release break lever we're gonna pull the break lever <laughs> We did it. We saved the gnome. Goblin scimitar. Goblin bow. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. I will turn this ba thing back on, sir. I was ruthless. Did you not see me? He's pretty lucky that it, it stopped with him at the bottom. Cut me loose. <laughs> What's in it for me? That will be nice. We gotta let our rage out. Oh, bag of Kamara. There's pustulant thugs. Well, get on with it. Whatever you are. What do you mean? That's so rude. Get on with what? You saved me. Now you'll extort me. That's how this works, yes? And I'd rather know how you got caught. Uh, my own fault, really. I should have dropped my pack and outrun those... Bastards. Alas. Take my pack if you can find it. The only reason those goblins caught me was its weight. I'll travel lightly from now on. You're a little far from home for a deep gnome. Ignorance is alive and well, it seems. Deep gnomes aren't restricted to the Underdark, you know. I've lived in Baldur's Gate for years. I'm in search of a friend. I fear he's in trouble. See this? I gave it to him years ago before I left home. I found it around the neck of a thug in the lower city. It was speckled with blood. My friend, nowhere to be found. But I still have hope. I have reason to believe he's in the Underdark. Hopefully I'll pick up his trail from there. I always help my friends. On that note, <clears throat> I bid thee farewell. If we should meet again, well, we will have met again. Hmm. You know, that's, those are those are true words. He sp he speaks the truth. Um. All right, where's his pack at? It wasn't up in the. Uh... 
padded shield. Maybe I need more pockets. Handle. Where was this loot? Oh, is it in the inside now? Burlap sack. Those are just shoes. Oh boy, a Ron Carrot. Rotten eggs. Wait, where's this bag? Is it up is it up top now? Marcus's pack. Am I just missing it? for power, but Gale takes it a bit too literally for my liking. I wonder how he does it. Why he does it. <laughs> I'm sure all will be revealed in time, but I don't like it. A waste of perfectly good treasure. Okay. Oh, is it downstairs? Okay. Shattered wine barrel. Look your basket. Heavy backpack. Smoke powder satchel. Gold. Apple. And a piece of bread? That's what you were carrying that they wanted so badly? You weren't willing to drop some bread and an apple? Speedy sparks when uh, the wearer dashes or takes a similar action during combat to gain three lightning charges. Those could be good for uh, Starion. Right? This could be good for a starring. Touch me. I've got a long road ahead. Keep your distance, dark. Oh. Oh, those are medium armor, but that's fine. He wears he wears medium. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he wears medium. No one stopped me yet. Okay, is that all that's down here? One day I'll catch a break. Hmm. We got some cool boots for him. Now if he dashes or anything. Does it work if he hides too? It says Barkus's pack. Still. Seems simple enough. Is that not his pack? Time for some bloody work. Well, 
burlap sack. Heavy backpack. That's got to be it, right? Complete. Why is it still showing me that? After rescuing Barkus, Root, we parted ways with him. What a silly game. It's still telling me to get the stuff out of the bag. What? <laughs> oh, it just said take the backpack. That's why. Okay. All right. Well, we got something done. So, the other thing is head down towards the tea house. I think that's what we wanted to do. Or should we go to Carlac? We get to Carlac. We have to go through the city here. How can I help? Oh, I didn't want to talk to you yet. We'll talk more when we get to camp. There will be plenty of time for it. What did I slip on? Actually, maybe we should go to camp because everyone is, is hurting real bad. <laughs> I just saw that. We are all beat up real bad. Um, Shadowheart looks like she has a quest. Is that what the green is? Or is that just her being grumpy? Something's on my mind. So, Gail just consumes magical uh. items like I do wine. We truly are a group apart. Nevertheless, as quirks go, that's a new one for me. So interesting. Okay. I've been doing my best to talk to everyone still, even if we're not using them. Need something? Why do you insist on exhuming the past? Because I want to know. I was a slave. A vampire me mean. spawn. Kept by the Tsar family. Perhaps I still am. I was never able to resist their commands. But now... I've been conveniently lost. They won't ever control me again. That's fair. How does one become a vampire exactly? It's simple. Just find a vampire that will drink your blood and turn you into a vampire spawn. Their obedient puppet. In theory, the next step is to drink their blood. Once you've done that, you're free. And a true vampire. In theory? So they bite you, you bite them? <laughs> yes, and no. The problem is, once you're a vampire spawn, they completely control you. They have to allow you to bite them. And why would they do that? Vampires are power-hungry creatures. They won't lose a servant to create a competitor. Trust me. It doesn't happen. Well, it has to happen at some point, but probably not for most people, yeah. I think it's better if you... St no. No. We got some more lower there. Lazelle, do you want to talk? Gale is positively voracious. Well, let him suck up all the magic he needs, as long as he doesn't snack on a Githyanki silver sword. She kind of likes him. She's digging on the gale. But she's also digging on me.
Gale slurped that thing up like a horse with a carrot. I hope he got what he needed from it. A horse with a carrot? What a weird saying. You're an interesting one, Will. How can I help? You are looking real rough. We need to get in bed. Uh, I was wondering that condition of yours. Why does it require magic? Think of it as tribute. The kind a king might pay to a more powerful neighbor to avoid invasion. As long as I pay, there will be peace. But should I ever stop, along comes a war. I can assure you, the battlefield would extend well beyond the borders of my body alone. What do you think, uh, what do you make of having a vampire in our camp? We all have our burdens. One way or the other. I guess he can't really say anything. He... We have a vampire and we have somebody that needs to eat magic. It's kind of, it's kind of like the same thing. One just has to have blood and one has to... Yeesh. We got a bunch of weirdos. I'm a weirdo, so it's fine. Alright. Time for sleep. Oh, Astarian has a quest for us. You know, I was just thinking about you. Remembering our little encounter in the night. When you tried to bite me? The very same. It obviously put me off your neck, but now I can't help but wonder how the others taste. <laughs> and not that anyone's volunteered. It's just an idle fancy. I wouldn't expect any volunteers either. Alas. It doesn't hurt to ponder the question, though. Take Gale, for example. He strikes me as someone whose blood is rich, refined, like well-aged brandy. <laughs> but the gift. What in the hells would she taste like? Hmm. Uh, I'd prefer a beer if it's all the same to you. <sighs> yes. <laughs> Heavens forbid we have an interesting conversation. Still, I am intrigued by the possibilities. This is still theoretical, right? <sighs> Absolutely. A mere thought experiment. So... In the spirit of theoretical questions, if you had to take a bite from one of them, who would it be? Um, I don't know. We, we haven't even like gone down this thought path yet. Sure. Mm, a meal that would put up a fight. An adventurous choice. We like aggression. Although, the more I think on it, the hungrier I get. I'm a barbarian. I better go find something I can actually get my teeth into. Uh, good hunting. Anything that keeps you away from our necks. <laughs> yeah, we gotta be sassy. Shadowheart wants to talk. Something's wrong. I feel... I feel... Ah, ah, it hurts. Darkness, protect me. What was that? I... I don't know. I'm fine. It's past. What and stop looking at me like that. I'm not sprouting tentacles just yet. I think it just glitched a little bit, but it's fine. Use your shared connection. Enter her thoughts. This is kind of like taboo to be doing this to our own people, but are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Forget it. Darkness protect me. What do you mean by that? I... It's 
difficult for me to talk about. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Just tell me what you're hiding. Oh, we have a disadvantage. That oh my god, she's not gonna be happy with this, unless we're unless we just god roll. Nope. 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 That's okay. That's kind of what I figured. She's a tough a tough cookie to crack. Please, it's nothing. Just let it rest. All right. So be it. So be it. Let's go talk to the others. Speak. Oh, she still doesn't want to talk to us. What about Will? You've got something to say. Nope. I don't, I guess. Anyone else? Gail, you got any more things to talk about? Go ahead. I'm listening. Should we just call it a night? Nope. Just call it a night. Okay. All right. I've come to say to you oh. and be sated. I lead. You follow. This is aggressive. So you think. Let's see if you're right. Gith train relentlessly. We know our bodies inside and out. Let me show you. Close your eyes and submit. The little leaf cracks me up so much. <laughs> we pulled the, the half orc though. I am ready. You awake in pain. Your back, your hands, even your tongue ache. It's time to rise. Dawn is upon us. Why in such a hurry? Relax. Come rest. Time for pleasure has passed. I might take more later, should my whims so carry me. Up now. The sun soon rises. Every breath, every blink proves exhausting. A long day awaits you. Good old boar. Oh, a scratch! What a wonderful thing to wake up to. Aww. What a good boy. Oh, what a good boy. I love dogs so much. We need to um, speak with animals. Hope you're keeping well, friend. I'm sorry. Uh, what happened to your master? Master, friend. I stayed with him until. Until I knew he was gone. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Aww. One more pet. One more pet for the good boy. Okay. 
I think that might wrap it up for the day. We're gonna we're gonna do probably a little bit shorter sessions um, than the uh, the like three and a half hour ones or whatever. But um, that was fantastic. I had a great time. Thank you so much for hanging out. Uh, and if you enjoyed what you're watching. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, like I said at the beginning. Um, I appreciate you guys hanging out. I hope you had a good time, and I will see you in the next one. Have a good day.